32. Nu kör vi! Open the door! Hi, my name is Jenna Espedal. I am the director, producer, writer, and I play Jenny here in this film. I would love to take you behind the scenes. Come check out Pizza Boy. Hey. <laughs> so first of all, I am forever grateful for the team and the actors and everyone who helped me get this production made. I worked with a very low budget and everything was out of my own pocket, so having the talent and those people come in and believing in the project, it means a lot. I think one of the, the, the best compliments I've gotten is that it looks like I've had a lot more money than I did. You don't really believe it, do you? Jenny. Not now, Mark! Working with the colorist Martin Steinberg was incredibly cool and I had never worked with color uh, this way before. Uh, I was actually in the office while he was editing the color for this film and, and give feedback and and learn a lot about his process and, and um, what color actually does to the film in different different ways. So that was fun. We have our uh, kid actor, Moltas, who did an incredible job. I couldn't have asked for a better actor playing Theodore. 45 trio. All right. Tack. And that was a far overraskal. And the mom warned us, like, when it hits 8.30, you're screwed because he's going to go into overdrive and become tired, and that's exactly what happened. But um, he kept himself calm whenever he needed to do the scenes, <laughs> and the energy was still on the right level that it needed to be for his character, so that was fun. Someone drew a penis in the hallway. <laughs> this uh, short film was quite different shooting compared to the first one, Erosion. This pizza boy was, I think, five days, but we had to split it up so it was two days at first around New Year's and then three days later in January. But Erosion was only one day and we were shooting from 6 o'clock in the morning until 11 or 12 at night. So that was a full day of everything in one room. Uh, here I got to learn about different locations, exterior, interior, both with the lighting and the sound and, and everything around that. So that was a fun experience. So we worked with a really low budget. I got a little bit of help from uh, the other actor, Victor. But other than that, I paid everything from my own pocket. But you know, you get used to all these low budget solutions. I mean, one of them, I bought like black paper squares and then I taped them to the ceiling because the room that we were filming in was completely white. So we had to tone it down so the light wouldn't bounce off the, the walls and the ceiling and make us look weird. <laughs> Every solution that I could think of was necessary just to, to keep the, the budget as low as we could. ENOUGH! I varenda tagning har han trillat. ENOUGH! 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 Andra klapp. Sen tio, tagning tre. Harris, Nivik are DOP, fantastic talent. Um, I just, I've worked with him a lot for still photography and he has worked a lot on commercials and documentaries for moving picture, but this is the first time that we actually shot something live <laughs> together.
Victor here is actually, you know, he used to be a stuntman and he had to do his own stunt for this one too. We didn't really have an option, it was not that difficult like, per se, but you know, people get hurt easily and I think it, it paid off for him to have that experience in the back of doing stunts before this. This scene was actually not supposed to be in the film because I had a vision of uh, just staying on the wide with Jenny in the frame and then him disappearing into the bathroom but we don't really see him. But we decided to shoot it just because we did a one take of it and it turned out great. So I decided to put it in and it's a great shot so it turns up the irritation in it. Yeah, I'm flat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> See you in 13, take one. Like Open. me. Wait. Like me up. What? You're so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Doing it now, so let's pretend it's because of this. Fucking. One. Sorry, that's two. Of the virus? It's probably there. Of the virus? It's probably there when you buy it. Which one of them are <laughs> oh, the virus was probably there when you bought it. What? Scare her, sending for me. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even think. Wow. I'm sorry. You're so much better making it rain. The set design is actually just my room and what it looked like when I lived in this apartment. The post-it notes were actually my real feature films that were up on the wall because I am a writer and I have this process of keeping post-it notes up on the wall, seeing all the scenes and structure and writing and adding notes um, as you get them through the year. A fun story is that we were shooting on really literally the last days I had the, this apartment because I lived there for about a year, a year and a half prior to the shooting. But I decided I really wanted to make a short film that would suit this apartment. Wait up! I can't hold my finger. Sorry. Sorry, I'm sorry. I can't show you. Thirty-four times. I don't know what the fuck's the head of it. Oh my god. Fuck. Oh. Okay. So. Again. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't want to leave like that. I think film is really the best profession you can work in. I can't think of a better way to spend your life having uh, so much fun both meeting new people all the time, it's a creative setting, um, you get to travel and uh, no day is the same, so, you know, it's, it, it seems like a real way to learn about life in a fun way. And me as an actress, I take a lot of different roles in different areas, and so I've played someone who's blind, I had to do research about that life. I've played someone with schizophrenia, so you do research about that. And um, yeah, you get a lot of input and empathy for different people around the world. I am a true dreamer, but I'm also a doer. So no matter how much money you have in your account, there's always a way to get this production made. And I think that's a, a necessary mindset to have when you're in this business. Instead of sitting around waiting for other people to... Um, to give you something to be able to make it, you just find a way. Uh, people are able and uh, willing to help if you, 
you know, offer the right things. And, you know, marketing is very uh, necessary for uh, smaller stores, private stores, um, or, um, you know, resume stuff, showreel material, um, experience for some. But, of course, I'm striving towards being able to pay my team and my actors. Sometimes that just is not the case in the luxury. The last song of this film is actually Victor's brother, Ludwig. You can hear his song on Spotify, it's called Leg de Har in Swedish. And I thought that would be a, a beautiful thing to take with me into the film, even though we have English, sub- English dialogue. When this film goes on to festivals, uh, we will have something from Sweden, and that will just be something personal for us in the end here. And it's also cool to be able to help him in his career. Uh, spreading his song around the world and and it suits this ending very well. 7671 Okay. Afraid afraid you're afraid. Oh, what's it called? Why did it first time? Don't believe everything I have. See, we are. Oh, oh, well, then I can't help you. You see, we are. Fuck it! Jeffrey from Berlin. I was about to find a lot of articles. Why don't you sit down and give me my way to monologue? Yes, sorry. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean infected? No. Oh, I mean infected. Yeah. Wait, what do you mean infected? Oh, oh. yeah, yeah, no. Wait, what do you mean infected? So far I'm Yeah, what's Wait, what do you mean infected? Okay, so you must have stood there. Or some bar freaking turn. Okay. Yeah. Wait, what do you mean infected? Oh. Yeah, uh, shut up. Clap, 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 $500 and I need to make it all tonight. I don't have time for this, so open the door. So, what will you do, Nancy? like to support me and my filmmaking please visit the web shop on the website to purchase organic products where all the earnings will go towards my future productions thank you so much and remember to put it into your art <laughs>